Hey, welcome to Atlab Games, where our board game playthroughs are always unpaid and ad-free. I'm your host, Francis. And I'm Anthony. And today we're going to be taking you through Rococo. So Rococo is a worker placement game mm -hmm. for one to five players, uh, designed by Matthias Kramer and Stefan and Louis Maltz, mm -hmm. uh, published here in the States by Eagle Griffin Games. It plays right. about 60 to 120 minutes. Cool. So Rococo is an interesting theme game yes. where we are going to be <laughs> playing as tailors. Who's Taylor? Taylor's. Taylor's. Uh, in uh, 18th century France, yes. under the reign of King Louis the Fifteenth. Yes, that is correct. Um, it takes place, actually, the board is the Palace of Versailles. It is, and uh, yeah, hall of mirrors and the whole bit. Yeah, so yeah. Uh, we will be building and putting together dresses, uh, getting resources, uh, all sorts of good things uh, in an attempt to get our dresses rented out for yes. the big gala event this evening. It's kind of like the red carpet it of is. King Louis. It is absolutely rain, the right? red carpet. This yes. is the, the final ball of the season. Yeah. So join us at the table and we'll show you how it plays. All right, welcome to the table. Yes. Welcome to the Palace of Versailles. Of Versailles. So here uh, we have a whole lot going on. And I think what we're <laughs> going to do is we're going to jump right to um, the setup, kind yes. of explain all the, because there's a lot to cover here. Right. Um, we want to get through it pretty quickly because the game itself is kind of meaty. But um, we have a pretty much every expansion possible thrown into this that came with the game, just to give you a flavor of what, what's, uh, what's in store for you. Um, so take a look at the table. Here we have uh, the lovely palace. Mm -hmm. um, and if you've not seen this game, uh, I'll kind of <clears throat> explain a bit, but I won't go into too much detail. So you have in on the board you, you, in the palace, you've got five halls. One, two, three, four, five. The most important hall being the royal hall. Mm -hmm. This is a hall that you're going to send um, your dresses up to the fireworks show. Right. And the people in them. And the people in them, yes. Yeah. So your, your clothing, again, we're tailors, right? right. So we are... Um, Outfitting the royalty. As best right? we can, yeah. Right. So this is this is all about gathering materials, crafting dresses, selling dresses or renting them out to customers, and sending those patrons mm -hmm. into uh, this lavish party. Right. To display your dresses. So mm -hmm. you want to make sure that they're basically shown everywhere and all around, right? Right. Um, on the board, there are a number of different actions that we can take, mm -hmm. and they are as follows. If you want to take us through yeah, real quick. Yeah, absolutely. So, uh, briefly, on the left-hand side here, we have our employees. And this is important because this deck of employees is also going to be our round tracker for the game. So, it's going to be seven rounds. Four new employees are going to come out every round for us to hire. Uh, second, here we have the Queen's Favor. So, mm -hmm. as an action, you can take Queen's Favor, which essentially is going to give you the Lovely first player marker thimble, yep. um, as well as five bucks if you're in a pinch. Uh, over here we have the market, so we have uh, both fabrics and also uh, we say accoutrements. Accoutrements. Uh, so like our notions, like our little lace cuffs and some threads and other things you need to make dresses mm -hmm. and frocks. Below that, we actually have the designs or the patterns for the dresses and frocks that we'll be making. Yep. So you can go there with your tailor and uh, and and create. Sew them up. On the, all the way on the right hand side here, we have one of the expansions, mm -hmm. and that's the jewelry box. The expansion. jewelry box, so, yeah. Uh, what makes this uh, expansion unique is that we're actually adding jewelry as well, which uh, we can get into later. But that's an action that you can uh, take on top of. Uh, well, when you rent out your outfits, then mm -hmm. optionally you can do this. Um, these are some passive uh, opportunities for you to send your uh, either your uh, assistants apprentice? or your apprentice um, or your journeyman out to get trained up. We'll explain that in a little bit. Yep. Um, and then finally, the only other thing you can do really out here on the board is purchase these decorations. So not only will we be outfitting the nobility, mm -hmm. uh, but we're also going to be trying to uh, support the party in other ways by buying these, um, uh, either helping out the kitchen staff, I think, thematically buying these statues, and uh, most importantly, 
getting securing our spot up there on the fireworks displays Correct. that our and fancy schmancy folks can go up each there hall enjoy. has its own um basically spots for dresses mm -hmm. spots for master crafted dresses and and musicians to play the music yes. for each floor obviously because that's what you need to do yeah. um the other action i'll go through in a second but I just want to talk you through how the player turns work mm -hmm. so we each start with a hand of five employers right this is your deck employees right? the, employees yeah. not employers you, you, are, the <laughs> you employer. are the employer so you've got two of these gold master tailors. These are the guys who um, can do most of the prestigious type work, right? They can do everything. They can do everything. Then you've got your journeymen who are, you know, on their way to become masters. Mm -hmm. And you've got your apprentices who are basically just starting out. They're very limited in what they can do. Um, so at the beginning of the game, you're going to draft, um, well, choose three of the cards from this deck. Um, it doesn't matter which ones. You can mm -hmm. pick whatever ones you want. And those are going to be what you're going to be playing for that next round. Um, so those go here in your available pile, right? Yeah. Once they're used, they'll go face up here in your discard. And then once you get through your deck, you flip them back over to this side and they all become available again. So right. you get to choose what you want as long as it's available. Mm -hmm. um, this player board basically tells you the flow of the game. This first section is for, for the cleanup at the beginning of the round, which we can skip in round one. Uh, this section here tells you to draw your three cards to play this round, which we'll do in a second. And down here it outlines every action that you can take. Right that Francis already went through. So you've got the market, you've got the funding a statue, you've got um, depute, which is slightly right, different. Yeah. And um, we don't do this a lot during the game because what this does is it thin th thins the deck right. and it gets rid of one of your cards. Uh, you do get money for it. Mm -hmm. uh, and you also get to use their bonus action, but they're gone. So it's a good way right. to thin your deck out a little bit. But With the jewelry box expansion, because we're training, like workers, yeah. we, we end up kind of doing that instead of deputing them. And so, yeah, you do it in a way, you kind of trade up. You'll so it's it kind of good. Yeah. Um, it's a good way to get money though, um, yeah. if, you, if you will. So then there's the, the, the tailor action, the queen's favor action, which cannot be, so there's certain limitations on what employees can do what. Mm -hmm. So the tailor, the, the um, queen's favor, and hiring new employees is not possible by the apprentice. They can't right. do any of that. Um, the only one who can hire is the master right outside of that is pretty much fair game um up here is is the new expansion so this is the jewelry box as francis mm -hmm. talked about uh with the jewelry we'll go through in a second but what you'll start to notice is that we are actively taking actions and if, mm -hmm. if we um if we actually achieve any of these actions if with, you take those experiences, if yeah, you will. Yeah. With one of our apprentices, mm -hmm. this this is their training to become a journeyman. It's the journeyman uh, exams, right? And then there's a master exam. Right. So, so our, they're like, we're going to test you. Go out and buy pink or blue fabric. Yeah. And once you've done that with your apprentice, then you can say, okay, you get check, credit. did that. Uh, once you complete that, then you can actually uh, take an action with an apprentice, anyone in your hand, uh, on, a, on a subsequent turn to have them take the exam, and we'll go through that once we do it. Yeah. So that's really all there is to it. We're gonna run through this seven times, and, and may the best tailor win. And, and, and then go to a great fireworks And show. have a great fireworks yeah. display at the end. So let's let's get this started. So right. first thing we're gonna do is just so decide play. which three. Uh, definitely gonna do that definitely, one. Definitely gonna do this one. And... <laughs> Uh, probably uh, gonna want to do. Hmm. Yikes! So I'm, I'm already, I'm already stuck. Yeah, we'll do this. See how that I'll works. Do that one. Okay. Yeah. So this, yeah, first round is, yep. is always tough. So go ahead and uh, kick us off. All right. I am going to start by um, playing my expert tailor, my master tailor, and he's actually going to go shopping for workers. So. Mm. Um, yeah, pay five uh, livre, yep. and I'm going to hire this dude. Um, so when you hire, a couple of things. There are four on offer. They're five dollars to hire. When you have four on offer, they mm -hmm. get cheaper as there are fewer to, to choose from. Same goes for our uh, lineup of fabrics and notions, too. Uh, when you hire, they come right into your hand. That is correct. So, so I'm going to go ahead and copy that because now it's okay? super cheap for me to do this. Yeah. Well, so I'm going to use this master uh -huh. to hire for three mm -hmm. that master. Okay. Kind and of that goes right into my hand. Well, now it's super cheap for me. I don't have well, a master you don't have a master. <laughs> but luckily, I just recruited him, oh. <laughs> so I could probably. That is 
cheap, 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 cheap. Yeah. Cheap, 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 cheap. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. Okay, guess I'll do, maybe I'll do some shopping. Mm -hmm. Might as well, right? Um, so I'll play this guy. And he will start off by... Maybe I'll start stocking up. Um, I'm going to pay two because these don't come around that frequently. And I'm going to buy this. Now how this works is... We, each of these has either the linens that you can choose to take and store here, or at the bottom you have your notions that you can choose to take immediately. I'm going to take these because there's nothing on the top. So right. uh, that actually gives me one thread and one lace. Now the cost, if the drawer is full, it mm -hmm. costs two. Yep. If the drawer has only two in it, it costs one. If there's only one left, it's free. Mm -hmm. I just noticed those are drawers. Yes, they are drawers. Um, Could I so please also draw one? You get your his bonus, bonus action. Is, his bonus is pay $0, draw, to draw a token. A token so, from the resource that. bag. So he's a pretty good uh, apprentice. Yeah, he's a good one. Ooh, wow. Uh, that's tough. When you, yeah, when you draw, you get to decide which one you're going to take, just like if you had taken it from a drawer. And yeah. I will take the cuff and the that's thread again. Done. Yeah, those are tough to come by. They are. So, awesome. All right, so I'm going to put out my other master and I'm going to recruit for a dollar this guy the journeyman yes Very that nice. one of course but he also his bonus is to get a dollar so she was actually oh, free. that's great well done mm -hmm. well so I've done a couple of things and I still have three employees to play la dee da mm -hmm. you're just filling up that deck I know there's some um, cards that'll help me later on with that <laughs> All right, I'm going to play my apprentice. Um, oh, and something we didn't, I actually didn't do. So I bought notions with this apprentice. Well, that doesn't count. The first action. The first one does. Yeah, the bonus doesn't count. So no, but you, the first one does. The first one does, because you bought notions with yeah. it. So you get credit for that. Yes. Um, now I'm going to go shopping with this dude. Mm -hmm. um, and he is going to buy for $1 mm -hmm. this. Fabric. All right, so you get credit for green. Yes. Buying green fabrics. Mm -hmm. There you go. It's part right. of the test. And part of gets, the test. He gives me two dollars. Two bucks. Yeah. Okay. So might as well get to it now. So I'm gonna play my apprentice, and he's gonna get this one for free. Mm -hmm. So that counts as getting a red fabric. Mm -hmm. Nice. For nothing, and he gets a bonus action of doing another shop. So I will pay two and grab that. So now I get credit for pink. You can get one credit per action. As long as you take the action, you can get credit. You just, you can't get it for two things with one action. Mm -hmm. All right, so then I'm gonna play my journeyman mm -hmm. and he is going to craft a dress. Um, so he's gonna just spend this two green fabric, mm -hmm. no thread or lace, who needs them? And um, he's going to build this gown. Um, now, the gowns and frocks down here, the last two all the way to the right are free to build. And these ones you have to pay for, I guess, like you're maybe you're buying the pattern or something. Um, <clears throat> now, I can decide if I want to sell this for $12 um, or I can rent it out and actually put it out in the display. Mm -hmm. uh, and I can't buy jewelry for it yet, which is unfortunate. Um, I'll put it out. I'm going to put it out. I'm going to put it up here. And okay. that allows me to take any of these that I desire, right? Yeah, so you're going to be able to cover up um, some of these like bonuses as you put your folks out there. Mm -hmm. I'll take this. Okay. Hmm. These are tough. I know. Okay, so I will I will send her out to shop. Okay. So I will pay. It's only gonna cost me a buck because those drawers are kind of empty. One, two, three, four. I'm gonna take this green. Mm-hmm. Her bonus is to get $2, so I'll get $2, 
and be done with that. Uh, I have one more card. Are yeah. you done? I'm done, yeah. All right, so with her, I'm actually going to sew that dress. So okay. it's going to cost a green and a pink. It's a lot of wasted fabric, but right. I don't have a choice. And a linen mm -hmm. or a lace. lace. <laughs> and I'm going to sell this for $18. Wow. So okay. immediately just sell it. Then 15 16 17 18 dollars and her bonus is to do a shop and i might as well mm. oh this is a tough call i know <laughs> what are you gonna do i'll take this one for free whoa <laughs> and i'm just not sure if i want the blue i'm gonna take the thread okay all right, so that is the end of the round. Yeah. And we go down to income. Mm -hmm. So income is five livre mm -hmm. plus one livre per jewelry item. Yes. And one livre per decoration if you've paid into the kitchen. Correct. Which, which we have not done did. yet. So yeah. we are not there. Right. One, two, so three, four, five. I'm going to bring change here. these out. Ten. Okay, so yeah, the next thing is if we had taken the queen's favor, we would change uh, player order, right. but we're not. So um, these last two would drop off. Mm -hmm. Everything slides down to the right. Yep. These stay in the drawer. Last one drops. Spots. These slide down. We have, here, you want to fill yeah. that? I'll fill the last two dresses. Um, and we can now talk a little bit about the other expansions because yes. I didn't really discuss yeah. that. Well, because the first, the first uh, set that you bring out, I think we try to make sure that they're not. Yeah, there, they're not. So. You're not supposed to have them in the initial setup, um, right. and they will come out after. And they are coming out now. So there are three expansions that are in the tiles only. Yeah. There's the festival dresses. Mm -hmm. There's the fancy yes. dresses. And then there's expert the expert tailor. tailor. So there's three different yeah. um, expansions that come out in resources and addresses, and they really just kind of mix things up a bit. Yeah, they just kind of make it more difficult. It doesn't change gameplay really. No, but they give you better, better and different and scoring stuff. bonuses yeah. and, and and ways to earn. Like so, for example, this this outfit, this uh, gentleman's frock, you can't sell it. It has mm -hmm. to be rented out, and um, you'll get bonuses for it. Right. By doing that. All right. We have to choose our cards. Yeah, so um, yeah. yeah, that's the next step. <laughs> <Right>. Three cards. <laughs> so we only have two left. So you have to take these two into your hand. And then you choose from the remaining stack when you bring it back to the left. Yeah, that's the, the um, different thing refresh. about this game is you're not necessarily like drawing from the top or shuffling or anything. Mm -hmm. You're just taking it to see who I have, these guys. I think I want to do Wait a minute. that. Oh, he's there. Mm. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Hmm. It's maybe that. Okay. Good? Yep. All right, what are you going to do? I'm going to I'm gonna do this. Play this guy. Mm -hmm. um, he is going to go shopping. Hmm. So let's see. So for two, he's going to go. Let me see what I want to buy though. Yeah, here. Like that. And I will take this one. And his bonus is to drop the bag. All right. Uh, another thing to notice is we have <clears throat> oh, these yeah. apprentice cards kind of sitting off to the side. So these are with the uh, jewelry box expansion. These are like specialized apprentices yeah. that you randomly draw at the beginning of the game. And they become available to you to hire, mm -hmm. only to you, if you meet the prerequisite. Right. And the prerequisite on her is to have at least um, three... Uh, Ladies' dresses, basically. Because yeah. ladies' dresses only come in blue and green. Right. 
And Gentleman's Frocks only come in red and pink. Mm -hmm. So that's just how yeah. it is. So if I get three of those, then I can get higher her. And it must be like the colors of the season. Maybe. Or something. Um, my apprentice, I need to have 30 livre in my, in my pocketbook. Um, so you're good? I'm done. All right. So I'm going to play my master right off the bat. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pay four livre. Okay. And I'm going to craft this gentleman's frock. It will cost me one thread and one red, which is exactly what I had. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to sell it for 25 livre. Yikes. Bold. Mm-hmm. I'm swimming in money now, so I can start buying some pretty interesting <laughs> things. I was thinking of doing something similar, but they don't know. But I don't know if I want to do that. Um, all right, I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play my expert Taylor, mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and I think actually, I'm gonna. I am definitely gonna build this gown. So I'm gonna do. Here's a dollar. Mm -hmm. Or a livre. Um, and I'm going to pay all of this fabric so we got and a cuff. So we've got three blues, three blues and, and a cuff. A lace cuff. And now I have a big decision to make. So this, I could cash this in for $28. Wow. Yeah. Um, or I could take the four points and turn it into a dress. Um, which hmm. I kind of want to do. I sort of want to do that. Okay. Um, all right, so I'll do that. I'll, and I'll put this up near the king. That's fine. There. Don't act like you're all okay with it. I am, actually. I know you are, <laughs> but you don't need to, to say it like that. Uh, okay. <sighs> I get any bonus for that. Oh, uh, no bonus? There's no bonus, oh, just to be next to the king, really. Okay. Well, in that case... I'm going to play my apprentice mm -hmm. and I'm going to pay 22 livre mm -hmm. to claim the three times the, spot. The triple bonus. Of course you are. Fireworks display window. You're you're taking my strategy. For end game. His bonus is going to be to get some stuff here. Okay. So first of all, he's going to he just bought a decoration so he mm -hmm. gets credit for that. He is now going to pay 2 livre mm -hmm. to take this and get the two lace from it. Nice. And since he bought accoutrements, mm -hmm. he now completed his, his training. apprentice training. So Very now good. on a subsequent turn, I can train one of my apprentices into a journeyman. Very nice. All right. All right. Well done. Well done. Thank you. I spent a lot of money, but. It was a lot of money. <laughs> I did have a ton. Yeah. Wow, not great fabrics out there right now. Mm -mm. A lot of blue. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not like feeling that too much. All right, so I think what I'll do here is actually spend six livre, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna make a, I'm gonna go buy a decoration out in the jewelry section. So Ooh. the way that the jewelry works is that you have to have actually bought a decoration in jewelry. Um, in order to purchase any of the jewelry items to rent out. Uh, and then she gets to take another action, so I'll cash that in for, well, I'm paying a dollar. Mm -hmm. um, and I will take... Yeah, so she gets a market action bonus. <laughs> I guess this one. Okay. Okay. Um, all right, so my last card is this. So I'm going to pay six livre and buy this decoration. And I will get one livre income mm -hmm. for every decoration I have, including this right. one. So that's just, right now I'm just starting to build a, a cash engine, hopefully. That's good. Because um, right now I have two yeah. on the board. And my bonus is to pay a livre to buy a lace or thread one two three four so i will buy a thread and that's it all right so let us clear it up cool so actually first is income so i yeah. know you get five yep and i get seven now because of my decoration mm -hmm. 
So we are get rid of these, sliding them down. Yep, these don't ever slide. You just fill yeah. them in. The last one falls off on the jewelry. Uh, what is this? Uh, this is Our the dresses. I'll bring out the dresses. Oh. I should have brought the dresses out. Two, three, and four. There you go. Uh, jewelry. And jewelry. All right. Okay. Good? Yep. And we are to draw our three cards. Okay. All right. So I'm going to take these three cards. Okay. I only have three. So. <laughs> All right. That's an easy decision. Easy. Uh, I'm still first player. Mm hmm. Um, oh my goodness. I don't really like those fabrics sitting out there. No. They're not great. Hmm. Yeah, they're really not good. Um, all right. Well, I guess I'll start with start with this guy. Um, I'm going to use this blue, pink, green mm -hmm. to build that dress. Mm. And I'm actually going to sell it. I'm going to sell it for 12 bucks. Yeah. All right. There you go. Uh, do I want to sell it? Yeah. I don't need money. I go broke really fast in this game. Mm-hmm. So I'll try to get some cash. Yeah, you want to buy a thing? Yeah, I do. What do you want? Um, I'll take a thread. All right. What to do, what to do. So let's start off by... Let's go ahead and pay five and hire this guy. into okay. my collection. Mm. Very nice. Yikes. Hmm. Ugh. Yeah, this is no bueno. Um, yeah, I want to buy fabric, but I don't really like any of these. All right, I'm going to go. I'll take him shopping. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to spend two. Mm -hmm. And you're going to get it back. He's going to get it back, right, so, so I'm just going to take this. Pick your poison. Yeah. Okay. Very good. So. And I get to put this up there because I bought pink. Oh, okay. Thanks. Sure. Okay. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and train her. Okay. So how this works is I'm going to pay five livre, mm -hmm. one, two, one, two, three, four, five, and then I can activate her bonus, which will give me two back. Mm -hmm. And she's actually going to go train off at the school because yep. I've met the criteria. So I remove all these discs. Um, now I get a victory point, mm -hmm. and by training her in, I get to look through the stack yeah. of apprentice. <laughs> and take her. Okay. That's so, good. So um, I will choose which one I want here. And that's oh, pretty interesting one. because what happens is you, you exchange two of these cards with two of the cards from the hmm? offer when you set this deck right. up. Yeah, I know. And one and of them is, one happens of them to is... be a gold, yeah. which is really good. Um, my, oh, I also now I move up here because I'm... I've done this exam. I can actually start working towards a master if I want to now. Right. My master's. Your master's. My master's Again. in business, yes. <laughs> Do I want another one? Yeah. I don't know. Uh, wow, this one's not good. This one's actually quite good. Hmm. Yeah, these are good. These are actually really good. Um, but it's really... 
Uh, yeah, I think I'll take I'll take this one into my hand. Okay. Into my collection. All right. Um, all right. This is kind of silly, but I don't want to spend money for no reason. So I'm gonna play my king mm-hmm. or my king. <laughs> to mm-hmm. me, he's a king. No, he's he's a my king. my expert. He my looks like Bilbo talent. Baggins. He does look like Bilbo Baggins. Um, and just to get the queen's favor. Uh, just to get so five. I'm gonna get five bucks. Wow. Thank that's you. Interesting. I've got th- literally three turns to take. All now. right, you go do that. <laughs> I should just buy more people. You should. <laughs> and just keep running that then. I mean, you could. I, I, I really could, yeah. So I'm actually going to use her to, or him, to do some selling. You had that already? Yeah, I oh, just, I just got it from there. Oh, That's a good one. So I'm going to actually buy some materials. So okay. for two... I'll take this. Mm-hmm. It doesn't really matter which one I want uh, because I'm going to use it now because I get a build action mm-hmm. for minus one pink mm-hmm. if I so choose, right? Yeah. So I'll pay five. It's expensive, but I do need to get. So this was just a pair, no accoutrements. Mm-hmm. So it's just to get somebody on the board. Yeah. Um, Hmm. Yeah, so what I think is a good pick here is putting the far left on that the bottom three? floor. Oh, this one. Yeah, because I want to okay. take a tile. Okay. That the reward one of your is a tile. Uh, here's a disc. And that's, that's, that's his turn. Okay. So for my next turn, I will bring out this master and I will sew do you like a partnership like a tailor tailor partnership like with lots of, of masters master tailors yes <laughs> master <true>. tailor <laughs> master tailor <laughs> master tailor so he's gonna he's actually gonna sew this guy for free okay uh, for red and a place okay and I'm gonna put this on the top floor on that one dollar okay. so I'll earn that and a disc Here's a disc. It's not a master sewn one, but it's something. Yes. Um, and he gets a dollar for every decoration. I've got two, so he's going to earn me two bucks. Yeah, it's important to note that even though the master sew, sew, sewed, sewed, sewed it, guess, he sewed it. Um, he sewed it. <laughs> he sewed it. Anyway, he tailored he tailored the frock actually. He tailored the um, frock out of that dress. <laughs> let me tell you. <laughs> <laughs> he really did. Oh my god. Anyway, um, he can't put it on the expert thimble mm-hmm. because it's it's not an expert just a pattern. Crack. Yep. So my last master is going to buy this decoration, so I can get some jewelry going here. Nice. Okay. Boom! And his bonus is give me a buck. Done. All right. Cool. Done and done. Done and so done. let's uh, income. You get five, fiver. Seven. I'm gonna get five, six, seven, eight. All right. This goes back. These guys come off. Uh, yeah. So everybody's running through there. it here. You're just moving along. Yep. We did not put much of a dent in the. Uh, the materials here. Uh, yeah, if you could start buying some of those, that'd be great. Oh, but they're not good. Uh, That's yeah. my problem. These green dresses remind me of Tinkerbell. Do they? Mm-hmm. Um, too, unfortunately, we don't have the material to make them. We do not. That's This is like... Yeah, this bad. is not great, oh. to be honest with you. Uh, did you not pick your good. cards? I did not, so no. One. I just need to pick and two I more. And I have all of mine to choose from. Uh... uh I do now. One. Ooh, buddy. I need that. Two. I think we'll go three. I I actually need... Oh, man. This is uh, tough. Hmm. Tough, tough, tough. Hmm. Okay. All right. 
uh, I'll do that, I'll do that, and I'll do maybe like that, I guess. Hmm. I'm so unhappy about this. What? I'm just looking. You're just looking? Looking around, seeing mm. what's available. Mm. Ah, I just thought of something. Okay, great. I'm looking at this because what she does is she lets you tailor for less mm -hmm. two mm -hmm. green. And there's a lot of dresses out there. There is. However, she is not an expert. She's sure so not. She's just a journeyman. Don't think you're going to get your right. grimy hands on that one. You might. Well, I might take it anyway <laughs> because there'll be more green dresses. She's so good. All right. She um, is good. Yikes. They're all so good. So I'm in a predicament. I'll explain to you what's going through my head right now. I have now 30 Libra. Mm -hmm. So do I want to take this into my employ? I get him, I can hire him automatically. I don't have to pay the five for him, right? Right. Because he's not technically in this office. Correct. You just have to spend a master that to hire him. changes things. I'm just going to swap this out then because I kind of forgot about that. So I'm going to do this instead. This is a big, bold move. I don't know how I feel about it, to be honest. Oh, well, we'll see. All right, so I'm going to do this and I'll hire him. Okay. So that's it. You're that's up. great. It's actually a really good move. <laughs> <laughs> but was it though? Okay, here we go. What I'm going to do is I'm going to play her and she's going to do a shop. She's going to buy this pink. She's going to get a bonus shop to grab this other one. Mm -hmm. right. End of move. End of move. I'm going to play my other expert, Taylor, mm -hmm. to pick up her. Mm. She's discounts on. She is, but she's going to cost you five. Yeah, she will cost me five. So here's that. Yeah, I never really am interested in her because I don't. Well, whatever. Assume. What, you don't buy these? I do, but I don't think that the bonus is really well, worth it. Don't talk me out of my move. Oh, no, it's already done. You can't take it back. So here we go. I'm going to play this Taylor now. I'm going to pay four livre to get this sewn. For a discount. For a discount. For one pink discount. And how much did you pay for that? Four okay. livre. So now where do mm. I want to put? Oh, the Englishman. The Englishman. <laughs> this is one of the newer uh, yeah. tiles. They have little flags on them mm -hmm. so you know where they're coming from. So like you get a bonus here, it, which is for every blue which right. I don't have any blue, so I don't even get the bonus, but um, it's kind of lame mm -hmm. for this one because you don't get any real points for him either, right. if you notice. No, I know. He doesn't give you points. Yeah, but he takes um, up a spot. But he so. does take up a spot, so I'll take the $3 spot over there. Okay. At least he'll earn me some cash. Mm -hmm. One, two, and three. And helps me with majority. So good. you're up. All right. So, so, so buttons. What? That was a pink. It was. So that does satisfy. Oh, yeah, that. Does a journeyman just crafted a pink? Mm hmm. I mean, look, this is all the same. No originality coming out in these patterns mm -mm. here, unfortunately. Oh, man, that's unfortunate. What? What would you like to do now? Um,. I'm going to pay four, uh -huh. one, two, and three, your... four, and do the ring. Yeah, you should. Because, I, so the thing is, with, with jewelry, mm -hmm. when you when you put out a, a, a frock or a dress, if it's a frock, it has to be a ring. Mm -hmm. If it's a dress, it has to be a necklace. You don't have to match the color. Right. If you match the color, you get a free material resource, which would have been nice, but whatever. Uh, but this will give me, uh, increase my income by one now. Mm -hmm. Plus be points at the end of the game. Yeah, that's good. It's worth it. Definitely. Hmm. All right. So I guess I will place the socks with this all this blue fabric. I guess I'll take our shopping. 
to buy some blue fabric that mm -hmm. maybe I'll need in the future. Hmm. I mean, potentially we could need it. Um, yeah, because the pink isn't doing anybody any good right now. So here's two. And I'll get this, I guess. And I'll pay an extra for her bonus. Mm -hmm. And take this. Okay. Okay. Um, can I see that card on the end there? This one? For hire? Yeah. Yeah. She's like employees in your deck. All right, good. I want her. So okay. I'm going to hire her with my master. So mm -hmm. she's only going to cost me three. Um, she goes into my hand. He's going to give me one livre for every decoration. So I have one, two, three. So she was free. That's good. Yep. Your turn. have anything I want to craft right now with those expert ones out there that's kind of tricky mm -hmm. plus all that red that we don't have <laughs> <laughs> it's like ridiculous mm -hmm. um, all right I'll just take this for free then mm -hmm. and she's gonna do her buy a thing mm -hmm. for minus five a decoration a decoration and I'm thinking if I want to go, I guess I'll do this one. So I'll do, I'll pay four mm -hmm. and I'm going to put one out here. Okay. Very good. All right. So my final card is this apprentice. Now she is going to shop and she's just going to take this for mm. free. And depending on how many cards I have, I'm going to get paid. And I've mm. got one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine employees. Nine employees pays me 10 livre. Oh my God. That's crazy. <laughs> wow. She is a cash cow. Mm hmm Okay. And I will play this guy. Um, I guess he's going to go shopping. Mm. Um, though I could put him out. Um, he could go buy me another decoration. He certainly could. Which would be nice. Um, yeah, maybe I'll do that. I'll spend, um, I'm going to spend nine mm -hmm. and I'm going to put one out here. Okay. For more income. Yeah. You get a livre per dress. Yeah, That's good. good. Always good. Good engine. Okay. So, uh, income. Mm -hmm. So you're going to get five. I'm going to get plus. five plus this is for my decorations. I have three, six, seven, eight. Plus, I'm going to get a dollar for each dress. Nine, ten. Two. Take a ten. Yeah. Oh, nice. So that's a good, that's good. I need that money this time. You do. Um, I'm going to get five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I will put one in and get ten. Oh, man. Yeah. Woo. The good guys are coming out. Right. And after this round, we only have two more rounds left, actually. So. Oh, wow. So it's so getting it's down to the nitty gritty. Okay. And so we need a lot of these. <laughs> so we've got. Um, and he bought a decoration, didn't he? Didn't I just. Or did I shop with him? You. No, I bought a decoration. Bought a decoration. So can you put that out on that thing right there? Yeah, Thank you, you completed it. You can actually take the exam. I did. Finally. For a change. Yeah. All right. Slide and. Did one. you you oh, you trash those dresses already? I had to. Okay. Where's all of our blue dresses? Uh, right there. Oh my goodness. You can build that one. All right. You ready? Um, picking. Hold okay. on. I need three of these guys. You already know which ones you're I only, only have three, have three left, cards. Yeah. yeah, I've got a couple of options here. Um. One. Two. Yikes. Those aren't bad. Mm -hmm. Two. Um, three. 
All right, these are my three. All right, lead us off. Yikes. I have no experts in my employee at this moment. <laughs> <laughs> That's not good. You should not hire anybody. Uh, well, yeah. I'm like not doing anything. Yeah. Wow. Shiza. Um, well, I could do, I could do the following. I could go do my exam. You could do that, yeah, actually. Yeah, because I can't even build this one freaking blue dress because no, he's an expert. you need an expert. You need a master. Um, so let me send him away. I'm mm -hmm. going to go send him to take the well, test. you're going to get two bucks for him. And I'm going to get, I'm paying five. So give me the two bucks. There's your two. Five. Give me the five. All right, so you paid for him. You're going to get a point. Mm -hmm. You're going to trash him. Yep. And you get to pick. From the stack. From the stack. And there is an expert. There is an expert in there. Expert in there. I think I may. Which is I should not take bad. him because um because I have those out anyway. Probably so. be wise. That would be smart, mm -hmm. I think. Yeah, he's a, he's good. He's good. He's a good. Okay, there you go. All right. Can you move my little yellow token up there. Okay. okay. So I'm gonna start with a shop. So I'm going to spend two to buy this, and I'll spend one more. To buy this and take a cloth and a spool. Okay. Your turn. I am... All right, I'm gonna spend him, I'm mm -hmm. gonna use him to make a dress. He's gonna spend a thread, two pinks, one more pink, and make this gown and rent it out. Okay. Boom. Oh. That's a no-pointer, that's great. That's a no-pointer. Oh, he only gets that if I don't put him out, right? No, I think you get it automatic, because you can only rent them, yeah. yeah Do I you have any blue dresses like out there? One, so you get a point. Okay. Um, now, where do I want to put him? Mm, that's, that's a tough question. call. Um, hmm. I guess I'll put him on the spot to get some money. Okay. For two bucks. Um, and you said I get a point for that, right? Mm hmm. Uh, and he, I used this silver mm -hmm. guy. That's a blue dress. So oh, yeah, you can you get that one up there. Blue. Okay. And then I can pay a dollar to get a thread or a thing. I'll get a thread. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Put your chip on him. Oh yeah. All right. I'll play my master to craft this for free. For one thread and two green cloth, and I'm going to put her. So she gets me one victory point per decoration. Yeah. So that's one, great. two, three victory points for me. Wow. Okay. One, two, three. Uh, but she's worth no points. That's the yeah, killer. Yeah. That's the. That's the rub. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna put her here. Take five bucks. Ooh, no, I'm going to put her here and grab a tile instead. Because there's no damn cloth. I know. It sucks. That's the problem. It sucks. I'll take this one. <clears throat> Your turn. Okay. Play him. Um, I'll pay two. To get this, and then I'll drop in the bag. Oh, I forgot. That is a master tailor dress that actually gives me mm -hmm. the top. Yeah. I'll drop in the bag, please. You're drawing from the bag? Yeah, for his bonus. Oh, okay. For free. Well, hold on a minute. What? What? I wanted to pay five more dollars. I'm still thinking my move out here because I'm like, in my head. Your I, move from last time? Well, I built my green dress. You're pulling one of my one of my. Well, it's things. like I, I'm just trying to think of all the things that I should be doing, and yeah. I, why would I not buy 
jewelry with that dress. A matching jewelry dress. that gives me yeah. a pick of the bag as right. well. Like so I'm just trying I to I hear you. No, you definitely complete. There's really that. no reason not to do that, right. right? So you went? I did. All right, so I'm gonna go. Hmm. What do I do here? <laughs> I think I do it again. Yeah. And I pay a dollar. And I build this green master dress. Okay. For this and a thread. Why not? Right? Yeah, no more jewelry though. No more jewelry. Um, yes, I could buy one of these. Oh, you could. Yes, you it's could. It's just another you could. point. Yeah, I, of course I'm going to do that. Spend 10 and get $6 back. And give her a blue necklace. Mm -hmm. Doesn't match, but it's still yeah. a point. So I will put her. She's another no pointer. She's killing me. But mm -hmm. she is gold. Solid gold. She's solid gold. And she's going to go right here. Yeah. That's and that good. just earned me presence in every hall. Oh, very good. So, so you get the presence the in every hall. Six point bonus. presence in every hall bonus. Um, presence and she, in every hall. There's presence in every hall. <laughs> so I'm going to get one of these for going there. All right. Your that turn. That was the bonus. Mm -hmm. okay. That was her bonus. It was. Right. Oh, no, no, no. It wasn't draw a tile. I was going to say. It was take a tile. From here. Yes. I'm gonna take this one and grab an accoutrement okay. of each. Yeah. Good job. All Thank right. Thank you. I'm gonna play this guy. Mm -hmm. Um and I'm gonna pay six bucks. Sorry. Um, I get a victory point per thing again, so I get three more. Okay. I did, there's just a lot to there is a keep lot. with there this. Is a lot. With these, yeah. these are the expansion tiles, so it's a right. little good, sorry. Are you done? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to pay six dollars to build this dress mm -hmm. with two cuffs and lots and lots of blue fabric. So you're going to get two victory points for every pair of red and uh, men and woman yes. dresses yeah. and, and frocks. Which I think I only have one pair because I have a blue and pink. I only There's have one pair. pink. Okay. That's a pair. Do you have a red though? Nope. Okay. So then you have one. So you get yeah. two points. So yeah, two points. Okay, mm -hmm. and that is an expert master oh, tailor, Chinese lady. Mm. All right, and she is worth no points either. You get them to make them. You know what I mean? It's a different way to yes. score. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now that makes sense. Um, and actually, I think I will slide her down here. So I get four dollars. Mm -hmm. She goes there. Now his bonus is for each blue outfit dress, I mm -hmm. get one dollar. For each green, I get two. And I have two blue for two mm -hmm. and one green. That's four dollars. That's four dollars. There you go. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five here. Five. That's it. Yep. So okay. income. All right. Yeah. So you're going to get five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yes. Right? Yep. And I'm going to get five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Um, oh, and that was a master dress that I built, so mm -hmm. I can throw that up there, too. Okay. So now we have to choose. Um, let me, before we choose, mm. let me recycle these, because that may change your mind. Oh, you yeah. To. Absolutely. This should be the second to last second round. Second to last round, yeah. We are getting close, people. Too close. Too close. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. It's like the same 
three. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's weird. So I'm going to need. Yeah, I'm thinking about what I need to do here. It's tough when you can only take three cards because mm -hmm. you have so many good ones. I know. Well, and you um, want to think about what you want to save yeah. for next time, too, and when's going to be the best time to use some of these. Mm -hmm. All right, I think I got mine. You figured yours out? Mm hmm. Hmm. For some reason, I'm playing this game very differently than I normally do. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, yikes. That's it. Okay, I'm ready. You ready? Mm -hmm. All right, go ahead. Mm, okay. Let me use him first, and I'm gonna spend two to two bucks. Mm -hmm. Take this, and I'll just get two cuff cuffs, please. And okay. then I'm gonna do his bonus is just to draw from the bag. Okay. Then I will use her. To pay a dollar mm. and just take that one. And her bonus is I have nine employees, so I get ten dollars. Okay. I'm gonna play him. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna build this dress. Mm. So three dollars. So here's your two back. Mm-hmm. And it's going to be one, two, three blue fabrics, two cuffs, so expensive, mm -hmm. but I'm going to get this bonus again. So a pair, a green and a pink mm -hmm. for two, two victory points. Yeah. points. And I don't think I have any other combos. Mm. So two. Um, and then I can put her out. She's worth nada. Um, I think I will put her. Ooh. Yikes. Maybe I'll put her over here. I'm going to put her right there. Mm. And get five bucks. All right. And. Let me make sure. Oh, and I want to rent out that thing too for four dollars. This one? Yeah. Okay. So there's that. It matches, so I can draw from the bag. Mm hmm. The tile. Getting on tiles too. Okay. And it's another blue. Um, I think I may. Do I want to swap this out? Yeah, I may. You want the cuff? I may need a cuff. I don't know, but I may. I'll take it. All right. All right. Um, I think that's it for him. He's Did you get paid? Oh, no, I didn't. That's right. That's the other thing I need to do. So I've got how many blue? One, two, three blues out. Mm -hmm. So that's three plus two. It's five. five. All right. Thank you. Um, I'm going to play my master. Hmm. Yeah, so I'll play him, and I'm going to actually craft that dress for $4. So there's 4 bucks, uh, 3 pink, 
and one lace. And that's going to go right there. Mm, nice. That was big points. That's good. All right. Yeah, I don't get any bonuses with him. Hmm. Interesting. Gosh, it's so interesting how this game scores. Like, mm -hmm. Can't wait to score it even I mean, Yeah, I'm anxious to see well. where, where we land. Um, all right, so I'm going to play her. And she is going to... Because hmm. I'm thinking about, do I... What? Doing more stuff. Six bucks. Right. Ring. Oh, yeah. Yeah, don't forget about those. I didn't. I just paid for it. Don't forget to do that. Um, I'm thinking, like, what makes the most sense. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Which is interesting. Um, all right, I'm going to use her to buy some stuff. I'm going to spend twenty. to go here. Okay. And then she gets to do a discount. Yep. And I think I'll do this one up here. So we'll do seven. It's like, is it worth it? Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I don't know. What is it going to be? Seven to mm -hmm. get up there? There we go. Okay. Not super thrilled. No, huh? I'm not. No. All right. I'm going to use her to build a dress. Okay. This red one here. It cost me nothing. Uh, or a frock, actually. But it's a three-pointer. Big one. And I'm going to put them right here. Yeah. It gets thread. Yeah. Uh, spend a dollar, and I will buy one of these guys with that. Um, is it? All right. Income. Yeah, so, okay. <laughs> this is like, ah. So you're going to get not good. five... Um, six, seven, eight, nine, mm -hmm. ten, ten plus one, one, two, two three, four, five, five fifteen. 15 yeah. And I'm going to get you. five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, and this, yeah, I didn't get one more for that. Thank you. Twelve. Okay. Um, that's it. That's it. All right. This is the last round. Last round. This is for all ready for it. the money. This party crept up on us way too quickly. It did. It's no good. Wow. Okay. Holy so moly. For that right. offer. Yeah, wow. Those are some... That's bold. Big ones here. Okay. One, two, three... And four. Okay, that's it. So we get to choose our final. Oh my gosh. What is going to happen here? <laughs> I don't know. Nothing good, I don't so think. I, I think don't I'm feel great go about this. One, two, hmm, three. That's the best I can do, I think.
definitely need him. And I think probably that's probably the best. It's probably the best that I can do. All right. All right, let's do this. Okay. All right. You ready? Yeah. I can't believe I didn't ever finish that dude. I there. know, that's a shame. It's a shame. <laughs> Such a shame. Um, such little little money I have here too, unfortunately. All right. Um. This guy stinks because like you have to buy him and then if you want to use him, you, you're already down five dollars. That's true. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, right off the bat, five bucks, right? Yeah. That's rough. Okay. Um, so I'll spend this guy. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't like this at all. I don't like any piece of this, just for the record. Two bucks. Okay. Uh, give yourself three points. Yep. Um, a higher. Okay. That guy on the left. Yeah, that's five bucks. Good call. Uh, he gets a ten dollar discount on. Statues, mm -hmm. uh, decorations rather, and yeah. a buck. Could be a statue. Could be. Could be. Might might very well be. <laughs> Could be. in case I think I will use this one instead yeah because this has a red oh it doesn't, doesn't have, have green. green you have to use that son one. of a gun garbage oh. this wasn't this wasn't well planned one bit <laughs> oh I would have really liked to make that guy though that oh, dress. I'm sorry um All right, I'm not gonna build that one then. Um, maybe I'll do this one instead. Hmm. I'll do that instead. Actually, that's better. Um, so that's actually five, which I gave you a five, right? I gave you change, yeah. So here's one. Here you go. All right. I'm gonna do this. And he is gonna go up here. Interesting. And then I can spend a dollar to get an accoutrement. Accoutrement. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll get another um, linen piece, please. Okay. Um, I'm gonna use him, and here is fifteen dollars. I'm gonna buy the two left top. What? balcony spots both of them yep because i got a ten dollar discount in the second you do both one. first action oh and second, second action. action i'm like what are you doing buying all those things yeah so he gets one action all anything right. he wants that down. and then That's he gets good. to do a all right decoration. Nicely done. thank you good job all right last last guy hmm. the last <laughs> guy 
I feel like I'm the only person that knows about that game. You are, because I don't know. I always try to explain to you what that game is. It's mm -hmm. called The Last Guy. And if anybody knows this game, then uh, you should comment and let me know that I'm not crazy. It's not me. <laughs> it's the Last Guy. Um, all right. Now I'm going to build this. Okay. Six change, please. Thank you. Um, so cuff, thread, all of my fabric, lots of leftovers. I, I must have tested out a lot of different fabrics. Seriously. Like making this one. And boom. And he is going to go. Does he want to go over there? Or over there, or over there. He's going to go here. Hmm. Boom. Okay. Mm-hmm. There he is. That's it. Very good. Did he... Oh, I don't get those. Okay, yeah. There you no, go. Not if you rent this type, you get yeah. the points because you're putting her out. Right. Um, so there you go. Um, and I'll spend five bucks. On what? And get the jewelry. Oh, it. the jewelry. Yeah. There you go. And that means I can grab an extra fabric. You can. Not sure what that will do for you. <laughs> we'll see. Because <laughs> you're out of action. Yeah. Okay. So why don't we go ahead and, and one dollar. finish this off now. So I think I'm going to go with this one. Okay. I'm going to spend a dollar mm -hmm. to buy this. And now he can do a craft action mm -hmm. to build that. All right. With this. Okay. He even got a discount, so I... He did. Could have built whatever I wanted. Yeah, you could have built that one. I don't too. even know what that is. What? It's a, bird. it's a frock. No, but I don't know oh, what that like reward the... is. It's like that or that, yeah. and I'm not sure what that is. But he's going to build this and put it out. He's going to put it in the main hall. Mm -hmm. Nice. Boom. Okay. Um, so he's done. This guy is going to go, and he is going to recruit this one. Okay, there you go. And he's going to get a dollar for every decoration, which is one, two, three, four, five. Very good. Um, that was stupid. Why didn't I buy the damn ring when I put my pink eye out? Would you like to buy the ring? I I'll well. allow it. I had the money. Not like it was going to change anything. Um, would have gave me fabric, but it doesn't matter because I can't sew anything with this guy. Yeah. But with this guy, I'm going to buy, I'm going to fund. Fund a decor. I can't afford that, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. No, you cannot. Um, but maybe you I can. You could buy one of these little little jobs here. Or that, or... You know what? That's a really good idea. <laughs> I'm going to buy. This one for 17. Okay. Sounds good. Flip it up so your swan is showing. Oh, I will. <laughs> so we all know whose it is. Oh, we know whose that is. Okay. Uh, that's it. Oh my gosh. Did you get your bonus? You didn't even oh, get your points. I get points. I have... Wait, that's end game. That's end game. Yeah, that's exactly okay. right. Exactly right. All right. So let's, uh, let's do some scoring. All right. All right. So... Walk us through the scoring. Let me walk you through it. All right. End game is gone. End of game. All right. So after the collect income phase, so we have to. Oh, we do get income. We do That's get right. income. So let's uh, let's count your income. Okay. Um. So we five. Get five. So let's start with your decorations. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then right. for how many dresses do you have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seventeen. Seventeen dollars. Mm -hmm. There you go. And I get five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Oh, I get two more actually for my jewelry. <laughs> Which matters. Fifteen, sixteen, and two. Okay, so income. that's income. Um, and now we are going to get first everyone converts any remaining money mm -hmm. into prestige yes. at 10 to 1. So right. I'm going to get one point. I get two. So 
one point, mm -hmm. two points. All okay. right, now evaluate any bonuses from employer cards right. on I your think staff. I have any you do. Who had the velvet background? I'm the only one who got one, and that's just yeah. this guy. And it's for however many cards you have. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven gets me eleven points. Nice. Big... You have like an enterprise. I do. Okay. All right. So now we're gonna do majority mm -hmm. in each of the five halls. Okay. So in each hall, the players. Um, with the most and second most garments, but in two players just with the most, mm -hmm. get the prestige. Yeah, so, so we're, we're not going to do, do second place. For every us. hall. Okay. So, so start... let's start on this one. Okay. So you're going to get two points. Mm -hmm. I get zero. Okay. This hall. Yep. Do we need to put them at the fireworks first? No. That happens after. Okay. <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> I am 100% positive. <laughs> Um, all right, so we are we're tied. absolutely tied. Right, so we're tied. We both get the points, or we both don't get the points. It doesn't, it really, doesn't matter. really matter. So we just won't get the points. We won't get the points. We'll just forego it. Um, Here, um, you are actually going to get majority because we're tied, but you are on the master correct. spot. So, so you're going to get three. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. Down here, same thing, but I'm going to get the points. I'll get four. Yep. Two, three, four. Here, I have, oh, we're tied again. Nope. You have. I have this decoration, so little, I get five points. You little sucker. <laughs> That's why I paid I that flautist over that. there. Whatever. To kinda, whatever. To kind of stand in front of one of your Majority trusts. up here, too. <laughs> you're going to get six for this. Correct. One, two, three, four, five, six. So now, uh, statues. You're the only one who funded statues. I did. Right? So for every. One of your trademark tokens on a statue decoration, you're going to earn two prestige points for each different color of your garments on the board, up to four. Right. So you're going to get a maximum of eight points. Right. So I have a blue, a green, a pink, and Do you have what's a red? the other color? You have a red. A red and a red. Yep, so, so you have eight points. points. You get the full eight. I didn't have any blue, so I wouldn't have gotten, yeah. I wouldn't have gotten six points. Uh, now, trademark token scoring. So we're going to actually score the trademark token. So mm -hmm. prestige points for all trademark tokens on garments, decorations, and haul bonuses. Okay. Um, so let's do yours first. Mm -hmm. um, oh, actually, no. We got to do the uh, fireworks. I was going to say. Yeah, we'll so too. we now we assign one garment per balcony slot that you've paid for. Correct. Only from. The Royal Hall. Okay. So this one's pretty easy. All right. So I'm just going to go. She's going that's here. Fine. Oh, that's you? I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm blue, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So he's going here. Uh, and these two are just going to go here and here. No okay. big deal. So now yeah. you get to assign. And so I will assign. All right. So now we get points times the multiplier. Right. So I'm going to get eight. Two, three, four, five, eight, seven, eight. Um, and you're going to get four, eight, and 12 20. is 20. Mm -hmm. So 35, 55 is down here somewhere. Yep, there you go. go. Okay. All right. So yeah. now we're on the trade market. So we're going to score prestige tokens. Yep. All the rest of them, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm going to get two, three, four, five, ten for dresses. Yep. 11, 12, 13, 14. 14. Are we counting that one? They all count. 17? <laughs> 17. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 72. Plus okay. 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3. You get two more. Oh, and I get two more. Okay. Still didn't make it to the side of that one. That's it. Very well done. Thank you. You smoked me. Got lucky. Yeah, you got lucky. All right, let's and go talk about it. You took my strategy from this one. <laughs> I learned from the best. Thanks. <laughs> okay so there you have it 
Rococo Deluxe Edition in all of its glory. In all of its glory. Yes. Yeah. I missed out on some opportunities there, I think, but that's okay. You did. Um, but that's okay. It as is. long as you had yeah. fun doing it. This is um this is actually one of uh, if we if we haven't mentioned it enough, uh, this is one of our favorite. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll cut right to the chase um, and spoil this. I know whole thing. we're going to spoil it. Spoil the horror review for you. Um, this is uh, one of our was one of our favorite games um, prior to the deluxe edition coming out, and mm -hmm. I think the deluxe edition uh, only made it even more of an attractive experience. Right, and, um, and why you ask? Is it because of the components? Yeah. Partially. Yes. <laughs> um, but I think it's because of all of the add-ons, right? I think so too. They may yeah. not seem like much. I mean, the, the jewelry box is a pretty significant add-on. Uh, we didn't have any of the expansions for the original base game. Right. Uh, but the, the jewelry box add-on does add quite a bit of meat to it mm -hmm. uh, with a bunch of different um, varieties. some extra stuff to do. Yeah, and the workers and the jewelry. Mm -hmm. it, it does give you a different right. uh, scoring opportunities. But I think we're... The true um, scoring opportunity change comes yeah. into play with the um, with the other mini micro expansions because mm -hmm. you've got all of those that's correct um, fancy yeah. and festival dresses and the expert, and the expert tailoring. Tailors. So you've got yeah. all these different ways of scoring dresses, mm -hmm. not just by put these victory points on the board and right. score it at the end of the game and try to get control. So now you can use a dress to get control of an area, uh -huh. but also use it to trigger a scoring at the time as opposed to end game. Which I think makes it a lot more challenging and a lot more fun as yeah. well because, um, you know, and not that not that the base game uh, of Rococo is vanilla in any way, no, shape, or no, form. No, no, um, But I will say it was, um, it, it was very clear about, okay, here's how we're going to go ahead and get points. And this is much more kind of point salad in a mm -hmm. way. Uh, where you are able to take multiple routes, um, can't do everything as you saw, uh, but I think that from kind of a replayability standpoint, you do have a different experience every time with this. Right. Um, I know that one of the one of the times that we played with this edition, um, I had actually had um, one of the assistants let me take a card from my face down kind of uh, available for the future workers pile mm -hmm. and play it as um, and play that person for their bonus. And I right. had this kind of engine going where yeah, like, yeah. I was just using that for the three points and I would just have a small yeah. kind of hand and just continue right. Yeah, because it's points, points add up. They, so they really do. I really just loved how the synergies worked in this one mm -hmm. um, with all of the new, uh, you know, kind of expanded employees. And then also, as you said, the opportunities to get points other ways with different dresses and, and frocks. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's really cool. I mean, the game the game moves along pretty quickly. It does, um, yeah. Even with two of us, I mean, for that heavy <laughs> of a game, you know, for it to take about an hour, yeah, um, I think that that really says a lot because mm -hmm. I feel like a, by the time that hour is over, I'm like, whew, like uh, my brain is, is pretty full. Yeah. So I, I think it's <laughs> well, is it fun? No, no, it's fine. I I wanted to tell them the secret about this game, this particular playthrough. Oh, what was the secret? That we played it once before we filmed this one. Oh, we did. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> because only because it speaks to it speaks to how much we enjoy this game. So yeah, I'm yeah, gonna yeah. I'm gonna tell you anyway. So um, we actually ended up playing through the way that you have to seed the deck because of all the expansions and stuff is mm -hmm. a little bit. Um, you have to be very careful with it. You have to take your time with it. Yeah. Uh, when we seeded it originally for our playthrough that we had sat down to film, um, we. We did not remove all of the cards we, we needed mm -hmm. to, I think. For whatever reason, we picked up the wrong pile or something. Yeah, I did it. And, I, I did it wrong. So. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's okay. I was trying to save you, but that's It, it okay. boils down. I'll take, I'll take what, ownership of that. What ended up happening was, I think we played like maybe two, at least two extra rounds. Yeah, I put a lot of extra cards in And there, we're just like playing, and I'm like, this is really great. We've got these engines going. We're filling up the whole palace. And I'm like, yep. We got to the very end, and it was like there were two employee cards left. As, as which opposed to four. There should never be. Which is the only way we would have known this. I know. So, so yeah. <laughs> but we had we were having so much fun with it that we played this extra long version of, yeah. of Rococo, and then immediately, obviously, we couldn't post that video because it was wrong, um, and we're like, nope, clean it up, let's it do, reset, it again. do it again. So like we filmed the we whole did, thing up to yeah. the very last, the end of the <laughs> second to last round, right. realized this issue, and then just reset and started over again. Like yeah. it was so, and, um, and that's how much we enjoy this experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, it wasn't a matter of, like, all right, we need to take a break. Let's get back to it. We yeah. were right back into it and enjoyed it just as much. And I enjoyed it twice as much because, because at that time like I knew exactly what I wanted <laughs> to do. You, because you took my strategy. And I just, look, the, the key to that game is own that palace. Area control. Get your people where they need to be. 
take majority and you will score score it is true points. it's true and i will say this too because we've played this at, at different player counts as well mm -hmm. um i do believe your strategy will change with different player counts so with two we don't actually get the you second don't get bonus the points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so it's kind of an all or nothing thing which makes it a little more i won't say cutthroat but it does make it, it, is. it, it is a little bit more, more yeah, cutthroat if you hurts. don't get that you know secondary majority i guess yeah uh, but if you're playing with more people mm -hmm. then you do have the opportunity to get like that second place kind of prize yeah. and um, more people are kind of vying for different things taking up it's just absolutely super super, super yeah fun. i'd like i'd like to play that smaller side of the board with three right just yes. to see how a little bit because it gets definitely gets tighter it does um yeah. at least from what i remember in the past with us yeah. playing it so we're, we're definitely it's definitely one to play again so mm -hmm. uh, in short um <laughs> what was one of our top five games is has become one well, of least, our top two. <laughs> uh, it, it's probably our, our one of our, our all-time favorite game. Yeah. Period. I, I think I think we can safely say that. And I'll, I want to add to that because I like I always have trouble committing to like what's your favorite game, mm -hmm. top one game. Yeah. Um, but the the thing that I do like about this, and this has been t tried and tested with us mm -hmm. on several game nights, is that this this game is accessible. So it is thinky. It's crunchy. It's it's a it's a lot of game as you saw. Yeah. But we have been able to pull this out and explain it. The theme helps. People kind of understand what's going on. You're not like transferring, you know, cubes into other cubes for your resource generation yep. and, and everything. Um, you know, so it, it's just a really, really good one to have on your shelf. Yeah, nothing turns a, a, a new gamer off than a game where you're converting one cube <laughs> into another cube. And right. that, that is just the driest. Right. Which we enjoy. We're fine with it. But, but if for yeah. someone who needs theme to really enjoy a game, mm -hmm. now I appreciate that more yeah. <laughs> obviously but i'll i'll still get enjoyment out of a drier euro right. um <coughs> lignum where you're really just converting a wooden cube into another wooden right. cube um and it's very abstract mm -hmm. this one is like you're turning cloth into dresses and yeah, frocks like that really is cool. it's right there it's in your face it's easy to grasp mm -hmm. that you don't have to tell you don't have to try to tie the theme into the action yeah it just works right and i think those are the best I wouldn't say entry games, but those are the best games to teach somebody mechanics without it really hurting their brains or right. turning them off. Right, right exactly, because they really get to, to kind of assume that role. Yeah, so and don't with let... the deluxe edition and all the components and Ooh, everything, yeah, as you like saw, that. you even get more immersed into that with the metal coins and yeah. the thimble that you probably actually use as a real thimble. Yeah, this is definitely so. one of the top tier produced games, like production wise. Which we expect. Kind of yeah, like this Griffin, is this but, is yeah, a yeah. lot Eagle Griffin games. Like they yeah. they do pretty much all the Lacerda games that come out. Yeah, you know it's in a Lacerda game size box. It's got all of the the thickness of the cardboard. It's mm -hmm. got all the upgrades. It's got the metal coin. Like it's just phenomenal it's production. Phenomenal. Yeah. Um, really we pretty. couldn't couldn't love it anymore. I don't think. I think yeah. it's about as it's about as good as you would ever hope that they would do a deluxe edition of a game. Yeah. Um, Absolutely fantastic. Yeah, really uh, good. Yep, anything you just want to talk about? No, I think I've uh, spread my love all over this game. So. Yep, so <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Rococo Deluxe Edition. Uh, definitely go check it out yes. if you if you like these types of games. Um, and if you like these types of videos, oh, definitely right. make sure that you, <laughs> you like that segment. <laughs> yes, that definitely was a make good sure segment. you subscribe. Um, we haven't been asking anybody to do that for the last five years, so we're we're trying we're to start this year. We're going to yeah. start. So um, we don't ask for anything. We don't again. We don't get paid to do this. We don't have ads on our channel. And we don't put ads. Like we <laughs> we like think that, they're annoying. When we that watch alone, videos, so, and quite, quite honestly, they just the the, the just I guess the, the annoyance <laughs> that you that you give a viewer with putting ads on doesn't quantify the money that you get paid because with ads on you literally get like pennies right pennies and I, I'm talking probably on hundreds of thousands of views you're getting pennies like is it even worth it to, to, to make you guys sit through ads for us like come on we don't think so so we, we would, don't uh, think so. we would rather uh, you just stare at our faces I guess for an hour and <laughs> oh, how good is it to just push on a video and watch it without having to sit there and count down from five to hit skip on an ad yeah. every 10 minutes or five know, minutes. God, it's terrible. So, anyway, so I all, all we ask uh, in exchange is uh, just your your thumb for that subscribe button and then I guess that bell as uh, Ring that bell. As your son likes to say. Awesome. Smash that. Smash that. Smash that That bell. notification <laughs> button thing. All right, cool. So we hope you enjoyed the playthrough. Thanks for watching. We will see you next time. See ya.